hi guys welcome back to my channel today we are going to be preparing a hair growth oil using a few of my favorite ingredients and the first one is aloe vera you can see my big leaf of aloe vera here aloe vera is a great moisturizer for your hair it's great for retaining the shine and the strength of your hair it's great for curbing hair loss and hair breakage and it's also great for for boosting hair growth the second ingredient we have is olive oil you can opt for any carrier oil your hair loves for me I'm using olive oil and then the third ingredient we're going to use is fennel seeds fennel seeds have amazing benefits for skin and hair as well as health and this is what they look like they are green and they resemble rosemary in a way so these are fennel seeds and fennel seeds are rich in copper they're rich in iron they're rich in folate and they're rich in niacin and they help to fight oxidative stress which results in hair loss fennel seeds also help to increase hair growth they help to reduce hair loss and they help to promote length retention so i'm going to come back to all of these ingredients in a minute but first let's get to preparing our ingredients guys if you're new to this channel and you aren't subscribed but you like what you see go ahead and hit that subscribe button and also the bell beside to so be notified whenever i post new content everyone kindly give this video a thumbs up it helps with engagement and it helps people who are on youtube for content like this to have that access now let's get to preparing the first thing that i'm going to do is to blend my fennel seeds to a fine powder and i'm doing this because i didn't purchase the powder i purchased the seeds so if you purchase fennel powder you will not need this step but since i have the seeds i'm going to go ahead and pour them into a blender and then proceed to blend the seeds into a fine powder blending the seeds into a fine powder will enable easier extraction of all of the properties that i need from the seeds for my oil and it's just going to save me a lot more time than if i choose not to blend so here my seeds are finely blended i'm going to go ahead and pour the powder out of my blender guys this smells so good fennel smells good generally and it just has the sweetest smell which is one thing i like about most of these hair ingredients they smell so sweet and when you apply them to your hair your hair just smells like heaven so the next step is to go ahead and pour out my fennel powder and this is what it's looking like my blender does not blend things to perfection but i'm just managing it like that so now that that's done i'm going to set it aside and proceed to prepare my aloe vera aloe vera is something that i've prepared several times in several videos on this channel and it's pretty easy to prepare for this purpose i'm simply going to separate the flesh of my aloe vera from the skin and i'm going to be using the flesh alone that's the gel inside of the skin and not the outer part Once I finished cutting up my aloe vera leaf, I had to quickly go and rinse because it was producing this yellow juice which isn't safe to use on your hair. So this is me after rinsing the aloe vera and now I'm going to proceed to cut out the gel from the leaves. Now aloe vera is very very good for natural hair. This I have said several times also on this channel. It's amazing for moisturizing your hair. It's amazing for helping to grow your hair it's amazing for nourishing your hair and scalp it also helps to reduce hair loss and promote healthy hair and cell growth the next step is pretty easy i'm going to go ahead and blend my aloe vera gel
and now my gel is ready I'm going to set that aside and proceed to start preparing my oil before I was preparing the ingredients for the oil now I'm going to proceed to pr prepare the oil and to prepare my oil I'm pouring my carrier oil into a cooker guys you can use any quantity of oil that you like for this I'm using a full bottle of Goya extra virgin olive oil and I'm going to simply pour that into a cooker allow it to simmer for a few minutes and then I'm going to proceed to pour my aloe vera gel into the oil by the way this is also one of the ways the aloe vera oil is made you simply pour your aloe vera gel into a carrier oil and let it cook for a few minutes and ta-da so i'm going to cover my cooker and allow the oil to cook for a few minutes i'm going to stir that at intervals just to make sure that everything infuses nicely and then i'm going to cover it for a few more minutes in total i cooked it for about 10 minutes before i proceeded to pour in my fennel powder my fennel seed powder so here that's exactly what i'm doing i'm pouring in my fennel seed powder and let's talk about the benefits of fennel seed Fennel seeds, like I mentioned earlier, they're rich in copper, they're rich in iron, they're rich in folate, they're rich in niacin, and all of these help to increase hair growth, it helps to reduce hair loss, it promotes length retention because you're not losing as much hair when you use products with fennel seeds it also helps to fight oxidative stress which causes hair loss fennel seeds also helps to add moisture to hair it increases shine and i think a lot of people sleep on how amazing shine is when it comes to hair fennel seeds also help to retain natural oils in the scalp it helps to keep the scalp clean and fresh and last but not least it strengthens your hair strands as well as your scalp so as your oil cooks for a while, you're going to notice that it's going to change from a deep yellow color to a lighter yellow color. And that is when you know that your oil is ready to set down. So here my oil is all cool. Well, it wasn't totally cool. It was a little cool. So I simply transferred that into a bowl and I let it cool down completely before it was ready to be used guys this thing smells so sweet this thing smells so so sweet like i'm not even lying it smells so sweet so this is what my oil was looking like you can see that it's green because of all of those ingredients but i simply put that in the bowl let it sit for a few days actually before i proceeded to transfer it to my applicator bottle And here we are several days later my oil was completely cooled i mean obviously and i was ready to transfer it into my applicator bottle at this point because i left it for quite some time the oil was no longer yellow but it was more of a greenish ish color and so i simply stirred up my ingredients once again and proceeded to transfer that out of my bowl and into the bottle so what this oil is going to do for you when you use it as a sealant i advise that you use this as a, as a sealant guys that means after you wash your hair or after you moisturize your hair with water and probably a leave-in conditioner you go ahead and apply this oil to your hair and scalp to seal in that moisture what this oil is going to do for you is that it's going to strengthen your hair strands it's going to condition your scalp it's going to add shine to your hair because of all of the ingredients that were included in this it's going to boost your hair growth it's going to prevent hair loss and it's going to help with the flow of blood throughout your scalp so
my oil is finally ready please comment down below if you would like to give this a try and when you do kindly come back and let us know what your results were like this is the color of my oil it still smelled sweet and i proceeded to use it on my hair and my scalp and that's it for this video guys thank you so much for watching please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up to help with engagement very important also go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the bell beside if you're new to the channel and i will see everyone in my next video bye guys